<laughs> hey guys, hey. I feel like I'm actually always coming to you in the vlog with like my hair and like gel braids. It's been actually a really, really long time since I've last vlogged. My life is very much in disarray. And we're gonna work on getting myself back on track. <laughs> because i've been off for a very long time it's tuesday the 9th of june it is 11 58 so just had a phone call with my management trying to like work on like getting back on track mate because i've been off for like a good month and a half i've done nothing nothing i'm gonna go downstairs i need to like organize the kitchen do my laundry and i'll come back Okay, I've been transitioning my hair, so transitioning basically means I used to chemically straighten it and I'm just trying to grow it out natural. These baby hairs be really, really doing the most. It's been like almost seven months now, so I've been really enjoying it. I'm just having a cheeky um, stir fry with like mushrooms and veg and no meat. <laughs> Not because I'm trying to do no vegan shit, it's just I couldn't be bothered to make meat, so could do with some meat though. But I only had fish and I didn't want to cook fish with mushrooms. I could have slapped though. I don't know why I didn't do that. But I had it. I had salmon in this yesterday. And I just felt like the flavours weren't meshing well together. What do I want to watch? I've been watching so many shows because I've had so much free time. Because I haven't been on socials and stuff. What would I recommend? Obviously, if you haven't watched The Last Game, watch The Last Game with Michael Jordan and um, Chicago Bulls. That's really good. Um, little uh, Fires Everywhere. That's on Amazon Prime with Kerry Washington and Reese Witherspoon. Yeah, I'm too much. I'm really bad at explaining, but it's really good. I think those two are the two standout shows for me, as well as Gangs of London. That's on Now TV. Like, ugh, I just need a place where everything is on. You know what? I might just have them all here. All shows I recommend watching. Five, four, three, two, one. You better screenshot. Anyway. I'm gonna watch Real Housewives of Atlanta. I've been watching it from the beginning. I'm on it. season one, episode three, because it's now on Netflix. It's amazing. Oh my days. I'm watching this um, Real Housewives, yeah. And I'm just like, Kim from Real Housewives of, Atla of, uh, Real Housewives of Atlanta. I'm such a stutterer, it's really annoying. She's so problematic. She's been problematic even in the most recent episodes, but like, the beginning oh god i feel like i want to start meditating because guys i'm not scented <laughs> i'm just all over the place and a lot of my friends have been recommending like meditation and prayer <clears throat> but i think i might do that today or later on in the week this is going to be like a weekly vlog anyway so we'll see what goes on anyway back to watching watching the show <laughs> People. just had a shower it's like four o'clock this is really bad did a face mask um i will link the face mask down below i actually did a sponsored video for this face mask like a few months ago um if you want to go watch it, i'll link it down below but long story short i love it i've been using it since december i would show you like a clean with me but like i said i need to like actually do up my room properly so you guys can see it and then i'll feel more comfortable showing you guys okay cool so i've taken off a face mask i'm gonna try the pixie fort eye toning eye patches i've heard good reviews okay why is nothing oh it's because it's that's what it looks like I've heard some good reviews. Oh, that was my first time. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Lid. Oh, this is gooey. I love it. <laughs> Let me bring my mirror closer. I'm literally trying to get back into like self-care and doing things that make me feel good. Am I putting on the right way? Is it this way? Oh, that feels amazing. Oh my gosh. I feel like I'm putting it on the wrong way. And then I'm going to put another face mask on top. I do love a face mask. You guys know I love a face mask and I haven't really been giving my skin that much love. Even though it's been okay because I haven't worn makeup, I'm going to give it a bit more hydration. Ooh, so I've got like a simple de-stress mask. 
some calming things. So I feel like this week we're just going to try different ways to make herself feel good. We'll see which ones I recommend. I've accepted that it's okay not to be okay, which is fine. But now I want to be okay again. <laughs> like this year has just been absolutely crazy. I hope everyone's doing okay. Many different things like every day I actually do not know what I'm about to wake up to. So just praying for some better days for everyone really. Ooh. Ooh, I don't know if you can hear it but there's gospel <laughs> playing in the background. We love to hear it. Oh, this shit is cold. These things never cover my forehead. Look how much forehead space I've got. I'm gonna have to put it. But then you've got all this space in the bottom that you could really put that in the top. Okay, actually it does cover my forehead. My forehead is just a little wide. Anyway, yeah, phone calls have really been helping talking to friends and stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna go probably, I don't even know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna like chill for about 20 minutes and I'll come back. Ooh, look at the little eye things they dropped. Anyway, I've also put some lip oil on. Oh, I'm just gonna massage everything into the skin. So, face mask is done. Yeah, I feel great, but um, I'm hungry, so now I'm gonna order some food. Um, I'm gonna be ordering. What am I gonna order? I had sushi like a couple weeks ago. I love sushi, but I feel like Domino's. Cause like you're either a Pizza Hut girl or Domino's and I am Domino's because I love their garlic pizza bread. That's my favorite pizza. Delicious. So I'm gonna order that. That is, that's, that's like self care, isn't it? That's self care, that'll, that'll make me happy. <laughs> like what I'm doing today is very much temporary happiness, I think. And I'm really hungry and I just, cooking is not gonna give me happiness right now. <laughs> oh Lord. Can this camera please stay down? I don't even know I'm trying to make it look neat. You guys have seen it. Anyway, false alarm. Ade has cooked. We've got some cheeky curry, Thai curry. Ooh, it's hot. I would recommend having a man that supports you, but also a man that can cook because I really couldn't be bothered to be chefing it in the kitchen. So having someone that cooks in your life is important for the days where you can't be bothered. But anyway, I'm back in the same seat. Oh, this hoodie. If you guys remember from my lounge haul, loungewear haul, I bought this as along with some um, knitwear bottoms. I love this hoodie with all my heart. I could wear it every single day. Perfect hoodie for home. Like you won't get too hot in, but it's just nice to throw on when you're a bit um, cold. Back to watching more Real Housewives of Atlanta. Oh, good morning. I just got my washing hanging there and my yoga mat that I'm about to use today. So today is Wednesday. It's like Wednesday the 10th of June. It's 9 40, 9.47, 9.50. Now, oh my God, my camera's about to die. Oh, for a hard time, my friend recommend, um, recommended me. She gifted me this book, my friend Tommy. This is not sponsored in any way. <laughs> um, this is Road Trip 365 Daily Devotions, Traveling Daily Through Life with Jesus by Jane Banfall. I'll link it down below if I can find it. Every day is like a meditation and like a little daily devotion. So today is the 10th, so I'm gonna be reading that. My camera died, so I was just like, you know what, let me just go shower, freshen up. I promise you it's not a new day, it's still the same day. I was saying to you guys about this book. This book is just daily devotions every single day. And today is the 10th of June, so the title for this, each day it's meditation and reflection. The title of this is Praise Him Early. Huh, interesting, because this is early, I'm doing it early. Actually, it fits. I didn't even know. So it says, when you write to God early, it means that you first and foremost bring him praise before you do anything else. No matter what is happening in your life, praise goes up first. It doesn't mean that you have to praise God in the morning, but you offer your praise and thanksgiving early on in the day. Early in the trial and always before you do anything else, your praise goes up. You might not be feeling great or your emotions will probably tell you it's not working. Persevere your praise and it will begin to impact you and your emotions. This is... Wow, <laughs> this is very fitting for me right now. <laughs> this is why praising him early is essential. Let praise be priority today. Wow, it is. <laughs> okay, so, oh, and then there's a bookmark, and I'm guessing this is her. 
the woman that um, wrote this book. Really lovely. I'll leave the link for it down below if you're interested. I don't know if it cut off what I was mentioning. My friend, um, I was kind of telling her I've been feeling really like anxious. I don't know. I can't really put my finger on what it is. So she recommended the Church Home app, which is like meditation, but like using, I don't know. It's like centered around God. So I've literally put in what I want to focus on and mine is um, feeling less anxious. This will, oh, okay, I don't want to show the chat. This is what it looks like. So I'm going to connect it to my speaker so you guys can hear and so can I. I'm just going to like close my eyes and just zen. I just find like meditation and I'm just listening to music. I'm just like, I just zone out to do it, thinking about things I shouldn't really be thinking about. I can't seem to like clear my mind. So if I have something to focus on, then that'll help me clear my mind. And it's connected to the speakers. He did this on purpose. I'm trying to relax. I'm Judith, my wife Chelsea. Welcome to Guided Prayers. But we're suggesting you take prayers. five minutes a day, just five minutes or less, and uh, clear some space and begin a spiritual journey. You have selected, it's why we're here talking to you right now, that you, uh, you need to feel less anxious in your everyday life. Ooh, I don't want to get out. Why do I feel emotional? Philippians chapter 4. Verses 6 and 7. Don't fret or worry. Instead of worrying, pray. Let petitions and praises shape your worries into prayers. Allow yourself just to open up your arms with your palms facing the sky. And let's take three deep breaths. Together. Are you? Hello. What? I'm not come in. No, I'm meditating. I just need to get some. <sighs> Can I wait for you then? No, you, you, you disrupted me now. I was in the I was getting emotional, I was connecting. Yeah, you can start again. Okay, so start. I was really in my vibe. First, you gave me a meek meal. No, I did. Yes, you did. The camera saw you, everyone saw you. Men ruin everything. <laughs> they actually ruin everything. Go. And put this back. Put what back? You move, no. The ra laundry rack. Really? And take your shoes. Take your shoes? I'm wearing them, so I need to go back. You're clearly not. I'm wearing them, that's why they're right here. You can take those shoes. You can take your Arsenal shirt as well, and your vest. Should I take my mat too? No, no. Oh, should I take my mat? No, oh. I, I need it, thank oh, you. Okay. Let's start again. Allow yourself just to open up your arms with your palms facing the sky. And let's take three deep breaths together. I just finished it. It was like a quick like five minute. It was nice, relaxing. Yeah, I think if I do this more, if I do it more, then I feel like I'll see a difference. Cause obviously I've just done like a five minute like listening thing. So I don't feel like there's a difference, but you know, you can continue and keep going then you'll see a difference, like the book said. Just wait to see you. <laughs> I'm gonna go now. You're gonna go, gonna go back to work. So I ordered from Casper's because I want their caramel frap, but then I was just like, if I'm gonna get that, I might as well get other things. So I've got like stuff to eat. So I've got the strawberry indulge crap and a smoothie for our day. You can just hear him walking. Because, you know, I'm just, ugh, the weather is just, it's raining outside right now. I just want to be snuggled. I'll probably watch something. It's 5.38. And, yeah, I'm just like, the weather is very, very gloomy outside. It's very, let me show you quickly. Ooh, very zoomed in. Ooh. Oh, speaking of eyebrows, speaking of zoomed in, look at my brows. I'm so hairy right now, it's not even a joke. I've got hair, like my armpits are just absolutely, oof. Last time I didn't actually sugared everything, but it's a bit long doing sugaring. Like I'm, us I'm used to just going to my eyebrow lady and her doing my brows in five minutes, even less than that, like three. I'm used to going to my wax lady, my sugar lady. You guys have seen her on my channel. Going to her for like, what, a good 30 minutes max and leaving and not having to clean up or make the 
wax or anything so now i'm just like doing everything myself i've just become really lazy i've just done um eyebrow remove like hair removal of my my face which i wouldn't really recommend because it doesn't get the hair from the root and i've been shaving honestly soon i need to go to laser because i'm just i'm just tired of seeing hair i'm really am tired and this quarantine isn't helping because my places i like to go even my nails but nails i'm not really that fast it's just my hair i'm so hairy hair on my legs my armpits my stomach my down below area that area let's let's not even go into there but yeah i had like my period which i didn't really feel like shaving i was like you know what? i'm gonna let everything grow and my period was probably the worst period. I think my period made me feel so shit. Like, it just made my mood just go so low. Like, what happened? I think I just started to get into myself and, like, overthink and, like, felt like, you know, it's just, like, no way out. There's no solution. You're just, this is it. Like, you need to accept that this is you. So, it beat me up because I, I, like, I'm someone that loves solutions and loves how to, loves solving the issue. And I didn't feel like I could solve however I was feeling. So that's why like, my friends were sending me daily devotion books and um, apps and stuff. I'm so happy I have friends that are very like God-fearing and very God-centered. So they can always like kind of bring me back to, um, bring me back to myself, you know? I promise you it tastes prettier than it looks right now. I always put like the camera all the way at the bottom. I have to mix that shit in. Hmm. I take back what I said. This is actually trash. It's literally just ice. Like, it's actually just ice in here. What a waste of a drink. I like that much liquid <laughs> in the rest of the ice. <clears throat> Weetabix for the first time. Oh, how do you know it's Weetabix? Oh, is it porridge? Just said close your eyes. I just it? don't have any of these stuffs. Okay, stuffs, stuff. Close your eyes. Open your mouth. Wider. Oh, no, no, no! Don't, 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 don't give, don't give me a big spoon, it's, it's please. Not, don't. I did. Oh, Trust I've, me. Oh, I've got like a weak stomach. Open your eyes. No, open your mouth. <laughs> Can you be fast? Okay, okay, okay. My shit's getting cold, fam. Can I please look? I'd no, rather look. No. Open your mouth. Close your eyes. I, I can't yeah. even see Can you leave? Why are you moving back? That's good. Move your hand as well. Oh, oh. It's in your mouth now. The texture. That was disgusting. What was that? Porridge. Wee bit. That is disgusting. It's good to me. As soon as it went in my mouth, I said, I wanted to say, take it out. <laughs> Ooh, no. It's good. Do you know what it is? It, it was soggy. I just can't. Soggy food, I can't. I can't with soggy food. <gasps> good morning, guys. Um, So, it is really raining today. The weather this week has just been awful. Look at my headscarf. Um, so the last clip you saw was me trying Weetabix. Um, I actually told I'd only like different like healthy alternatives for breakfast. So I bought like Weetabix and I've honestly had it in there for like a month and I haven't touched it. So added, gave me it to try today because I've been scared to try it. I, I'm not really a porridge person. I'm not a Weetabix person. I was like, you know, let me like come out of my comfort zone. Let me grow up because I, ever since I was a kid, soggy food I used to just spit out and yogurt. I just, I haven't, I'm just not that person because he was like, this has been in the cupboard for a month now and you haven't tried it, so I tried it. We'll never be doing that again. No thank you, no ma'am, no thanks. I should have never trusted his judgment to be honest. So I'm just gonna have a cheeky cuppa, breakfast bar, and then gonna go do food shopping because I legit have no food. When no one has a pound. Oh my god, they're all stacked up on top of each other. Mm -hmm. It's hot. I had a whole bomber jacket. I was boiling. An actual bomber jacket. Ah, I had to literally unzip when I got in here. Anyway, food shopping done. Ah, I'm low-key dreading washing my hair. This wash day shit, it ain't a joke. 
but i get build up so easy on my head i literally need to wash it like every 10 days come on mate let's get you out time to wash this hair Off my mood, you know. 100%. I'm with Naya, I'm at Naya's house. She lives right next door to Hello. her hairstylist. So hang okay. on. Let me show you her room. Her this room is, is so cute. Okay, I've got my all my right, rubbish. I've got, okay, of course. Give me a okay. Follow me. Oh, oh right. This is the wardrobe. Oh. As you can see, it slides. I'm not opening it because it's messy. So that's the vibe. Mm. me. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> and then the table. I love this room. I yeah. wish I could show you guys what it looked like before so you can see like the Yeah, difference. before it just wasn't it. But like, let me even stand outside so you can give you like a real. Oh, I just love this room. So nice, so open. Vibes. Oops, okay. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. Oh. I always love looking at people's perfume collections. It's basically the same as yours, kind of. Kind of. This is Prada, isn't it? No. It's no. Do you know Juicy what? You really Couture. like this one. Okay, hang on. Open the lid. Joe, it's finished. That's why I have it there. Oh, so I'm right. to re up and buy a new one. Smart. <laughs> Mm. Do you know what is? My mum would love this as well. She like loves sweet. Yeah, it's really sweet. It's really sweet, but really nice. Oh, shit. This. Do you know what is? You like a lot of the stuff my mum likes. Is this. Yeah, yeah, my mum yeah. loves this. I love that one. Yeah. You you literally have the same type of collection. My mum's going to be watching this. Like, oh my god, I like this. <laughs> I have this. It's my favourite. Um, that one is more like my grandma perfume. I don't really wear that one. I can't even smell anything. I don't know why, because mm. that's the Zara one. Is this a unisex one? Yeah. Yeah, I, I like it. it. But I mix it with like a sweeter mm -hmm. perfume just to mm -hmm. like deepen it out of it. I hear you. Wait, where's the perfume called? The sauce. Boy, I love it. I love the perfume. I love it. Boys and girls, like men and women, I will smell them all. It's just so nice smelling nice. I think the best compliment mm -hmm. is you smell nice. I love it. Mm. I love it. Love Tell me that's not good. We are filming a mukbang. And guess what we got? It's actually no surprise we got sushi. What else are we gonna eat? What else are we actually gonna eat? What else are we gonna okay. eat? Okay. We're gonna film for my channel as well as her channel. We're filming Ooh. hers first, so. Ha! Actually, I think this vlog will go up before the video, so just so they know. Just so they know. It's coming. It's coming. We're filming. Let's do it. Jeez. Inject it. Inject it. Inject content. Huh? Okay, we've done like a whole afternoon of filming. We are done. Videos done. should be going up soon. I am tired. It's what? Like, what's the time? Look at the time. It's late. <laughs> it's late. That's all you guys. You've been filming for a minute. Yeah. Oh, anyway. I'll probably talk to you guys when I get home. Oh, I'm on my way home. Bye, guys. Bye. I've missed you guys, you know. Not yeah, gonna lie. Let me just. Let me have a minute because okay, wow. I've really missed you guys. Like, on a serious note, like, I feel like we have some really great times. Mm. Like, you know, we went to Ibiza together, went mm -hmm. to Paris together. Like, we went to the, what's it, sex education? Sex education together. together. Like, we go through things. Like, how have y'all been? Wow. Like, how have you been doing? Like, yeah. mm -hmm. mm, oh. this camera and its yeah. angles. Oh. Doing bitch. Oh, we both got nice sprays. I know. How amazing. How amazing. Yours. But anyway, guys, it's been great. I've missed you all. I will be coming here more often. Because Ben is back on the vlogging oh game! Oh <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Bella's back making Ooh. vlogs and we're all excited for it. We're so excited. I'm Sorry. Excited I'm, to just, be back. I'm just speaking for you. I'm speaking ah! for all of us. I'm okay. speaking for all of us. We're excited. Me and my homegirls. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Yay! Okay. But anyway, that's me, Ben. Right, cool.